guys welcome back to my channel so today i am actually gonna be doing a tutorial for you guys so as of right now i do not know what i'm gonna do but um let's see what we can create i know i did this um pictures i just like literally slapped makeup on my face put the choker on dress on and i took pictures um i don't remember what i did oh no this is my favorite part i'm watching a show um and people are requesting for me to do a tutorial so i don't know what i'm gonna do i'll probably do a separate video on that once i know what i'm gonna do but right now i'm just gonna do this last slide this year um i have a lot of new products so i'm gonna do that um the only new products that i don't have is of course the eyeshadows but other than that guys we are gonna do some new testing things so go ahead because I'm, I'm gonna like branch out of my comfort zone guys because i don't want to be just like stuck like oh makeup star makeup star no i'm gonna be like we should probably be doing a review okay sorry for not cussing guys i cuss a lot okay so let's go ahead and get started so guys this is the primer i'm gonna use this is <coughs> i'm eating hot cheetos and i have like a cough really weird so this is up from city color it's an oil control primer spray I used the Smashbox for a while, it was just like a little sample one. I loved it, so I was gonna buy it, but I don't know. So I just tried, let me see, try this. Let me talk through guys, if you all don't mind, because I like talk throughs better than voiceovers. It's a lot of work to do voiceovers. I'm gonna do a talk through. Let's see, I'm gonna put them to lose weight, but. You guys know me, you guys know I love my chips, so it's hard for me not. So for foundation, this is the Wet n Wild foundation. I have been literally wanting this for a while. I know they haven't had this out in the market for so long, um, but they had it online. I saw I have them on Snapchat and I saw them use it, people use it and stuff, and I was like, Ooh, that sounds like a good right price range and it has no flashback no none of that so i was like oh so let's try it so i don't know about the coverage i only watched one video on it i really didn't want to watch videos because i know me i go based on their opinion i'm gonna go based on my opinion and show you guys what i feel about it um so yeah I'll, like try it on it but it is cruelty free so it, and i am in the shade desert beach the good thing about this is they have a spatula like cool it's not a poop it's not like a things like that so let's just slap it on hopefully this is a shade okay this smells weird it has a like a paint like a yeah like it has great coverage Okay, y'all, yeah, we're gonna work with this fast because I think it like, dries quick later. I just the scent. Uh, not my fave. Mm -hmm. I'm wrong, but so I'm gonna be using this Revlon Photo Ready. This is not my first time using this concealer. Um, I would use this one, but um, since this is not giving me good coverage, this gives me enough coverage. So I'm just gonna like put this on. Oh, it's not covering. Right now, I'll go back and do my eyebrows and my hands. One downside about this concealer is that if you like move it like that, it will take away all like you have there. So that is one downside about this product. But other than that, it's really good. It's really good for brightening. Can you all tell about that? Like, I'm going crazy. Okay. It's not coming up as great on camera. Okay, I really can't see, guys, because I don't have my contacts on or my glasses. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and set it with the airspun powder. If you guys have any, like, good drugstore ones or like anything like that 
tell me because I need a new try something new okay guys so we're gonna put some trousers so then I'm gonna go in with bronzer I did the trousers and powder off screen because you guys see me do that a thousand times so okay this is broken but I'm gonna go in with this one and I'm gonna contour this is the brush from Danielle it's an English blush brush I don't know where my sister got this from I got it for Christmas I really like it So this year, I'm trying to like get a camera. I'm gonna get one. Try to do a lot of more stuff, improvement, and things like that. Be more dedicated to my channel and my Instagram. If you guys are following me, Instagram, follow me, and Snapchat and Twitter and all that fun things. Cause I post a lot on Snapchat, Instagram, and I'm gonna try to go like with the feed. Cause I know a lot of people do that. And I like it, so I'm gonna do it. It's not showing up, it looks nice on camera. And then, first, I'm gonna do it this way. So, I'm gonna go with the little. Mm. So, you guys, my friend messaged me Jared, how you doing? <laughs> We're gonna go with that. Then a little bronze. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go in with banana shit. Just put it, take it out, and then I'm just gonna like pat it in and then sweep it. So you guys, normally I'm not a big fan of blush, but I will put some because I'll always go. So I'm gonna use the Tarte one in Prism. It's a light shade. So, guys, I want to feature, like, my best friend on here. My, my, my best best friend. Um, do, like, a best friend tag or something. Because I know I did one with Sanger. Um, I want to do one with my best friend. And that, because that girl knows me from heck to hell. She knows me, my mama, my soul, and everything. So, I also want to do one with my sisters. Hopefully, if you want to do it. I'm going to leave so, you see, it's, like, light, but quick, but good. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna add some MAC Fix Plus. We're gonna spray it on the face and we're gonna add some highlights. Okay? <laughs> so, we're just gonna let it dry. We're gonna go for like a subtle highlight. Okay. So, we're gonna go into Golden Bronze. We're just gonna dip it all over. Okay? I always say these, but then it's actual all of them. So then I'm gonna go into sunburst and dripping in gold. Just put it down my nose. No, I keep it low. So pretty. I'm just gonna go in with the same concealer that I use, and I'm going to be going under my eyebrows. I like to do this first before. So this brush guys, I love it. Have it and had it already. I got it in my Ipsy bag like last year. I don't know why I stopped getting them. <laughs> but I stopped. And then whatever's left, I'm gonna go in with the bronze. I know most people I like this trick more because it helps you like do whatever you want. Um I'm gonna Jenny, if you guys know Jenny69, um, she does this, and I learned it from her. Oh my god, you. So, 
go down, down, down. Down, down, down. Guess I'm gonna start filming videos late at night because it's not quiet in my house. Where's, like, it's never quiet, guys. I painted in my room, so that's where else I can film and a lot of other things. So I'm just gonna, like, with the stick. Sorry, someone messed me up. Someone wrote my beat blender. Just there's already people going to sleep. All my friends are telling me good night. Well, I'm filming the video. <laughs> I bought the Urban Decay. Um, oh, I need to have a lot of Cheetos in my eye. Uh, powder for the eyes. I mean the powder. Um. Lotion for the eyes and oh my god no it's not the way I like it but it's okay I'll think it's somebody so now I'm gonna use Anastasia brow wiz in her medium brown and then I'm just gonna look under I really don't have nothing specific since um I have full brows and So, yeah, just trying to like wean it. I'm not an expert at brows, guys. Um, I'm just weaning it. Whatever comes out, comes out. See, guys, how, see how more full that is? Okay, I really don't like the way this came out, but. All I ate was, oh, okay, this came out thicker. This eyebrow is thicker than this one. So. And by the way, guys, um, I am transforming this room into, like, a beauty room also. Just so that you all know. So it'll be different. Um, that's why I changed it to blue, I mean, to white, beige. Um. And then I'm also going to be doing like those little picture frames thing. My cousin's going to like paint some for me and do a, like different things. I do just want to print them out and do like different. So then I'm going to be going into this elf um, whiz thing. I don't know, one of my favorites so far. I bought it like a few days ago and it's like really good. So I'm just going to set it so it can lay down. Like I said, guys, one eyebrow is thicker than the other. But anyways, I'm not perfect, but like, so there's no rules. And if there was, I wouldn't have known that. Shut up. So we are going to go into this Beauty Treats Modern Matte Palette. This is, I did buy this at a local store. Um, I don't know if they have it in up there, but it's called Casa Kevin. I don't know. Really cool. I bought a lot of stuff from there. I'm um, very cheap and... I have them on this beauty page on uh, Facebook and they're like all ranting about it. I also bought my checker from there, which I'm going to put on in a bit, but I'm going to use this. So I'm going to go into this shade. It it looks like a dupe from the burnt orange shade. That's what I use um, for my transition shade. This one, so I'm just going to put it across my crease. Um, messily, not like perfect or anything. So there's nothing like coming up and... That is fine because it is a transition shade. So and then I am then going to go to the Target and Bloom palette. I need a new palette, guys. If you guys have any recommendations on a good palette, tell me. I need to buy a new one. Um, other than Tarte Cosmetics, but if it is Tarte, then that's fine. Um, I'm gonna go into Rebel. And then just like go on my crease. Can y'all see that? Go. On my crease and go back to my Kiko brush and then just so it's all blended. You see that? It's pretty. I'm gonna go into the other eye. I'm then gonna go in Leader, which is a really dark maroon shade. I'm just gonna like put this brush, like it's like a flat brush, and I'm just gonna like 
kind of like go upwards and just put this on my crease, like on above my crease. I'm not gonna do any quick cut crease, but we're gonna try. Not try, but like kind of like mean it. It's what I like to do a lot because I'm really lazy to do a cut crease and I really, really like try to do one, like put like all my effort in it. I'm just like free hand, whatever I do, it comes out, comes out. I should do one though. So that's how it looks so far. I'm just gonna go natural on the eyes. I like to do natural on the eyes a lot. So that is it for the eyes. Um, we are gonna, it's because we are gonna do up my boom lashes. Oh my god, the highlight is giving me life right now. I'm so excited for these lashes, guys. Um, this is the Nicole Guerrero um, with Eyler Cosmetics. This is a vlogger series. They have um, a couple of other, I think they have like three more other bloggers. Um, but she's my favorite vlogger, so I got her. And I wanted to try the other ones, but like, uh, she has two. Which are these and the other ones. I wanted to get the other ones more. Because that's more me. But I was like, I'm still going to support her. So I got this. And it looks pretty um, dramatic. It's home for mine. For me. But we're just going to go with it. No eyeliner today. Not a love to do eyeliner. But we're just going to use without eyeliner. See how it looks. Oh. So I come with a little glue. I'm going to use this glue. Since I have no glue on my hands right now. So I already applied the glue, so we're just gonna wait for it to get a little tight, guy. I would usually go on the other one, but I took a lot of time on this. Let me just comb through my eyelashes. Didn't do that, I forgot. Okay, hold up, guys. I just wanted to make a little mascara. So we are gonna put some the eyelashes on. I'm kind of scared. Oh my god. I'm covered with me. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so bad. Ugh. Lately, the eyelash glues, like I've, you know, worn eyelashes, they've been hurting my eyes. So I don't know if I should. Lay out cute in my eyes. I don't know how I feel about this. Okay, these are not my favorite guys. So you know I always go with like wispy lashes, but look so dramatic like and they look long here but it's just the shadow I don't know I don't know how I feel bottom either way I bottom just like to support her not like really much but I wanted to find the other ones because the other ones were like my favorite I'm just like look at the glow guys oh my god okay let's move like that well, just like look in here, they look so natural on me. And I'm like, bam, bam, girl, like, we ain't messing with you today. Anyways, we're gonna go in with the Cat Von D Lolita lipstick. So I'm gonna burn my camera. My camera, my. You wanna see my laptop? So I wanted to do it like, uh, Best of Beauty 2016, but it didn't. I wasn't able to. And I can still do it, right? But so 
So let me go change and I'll be there. So I can get on real quick. Okay, I already changed, but I'm gonna put a little bit of gloss on because I'm gonna be extra today. Anyone else ready? Almost 11 at night. You wanna take this off right after. We won't sleep tonight. Okay. So thank you guys so much for watching my video. I really, really, really hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, this is something fun. I really liked the way it came out. You know, the highlights, everything, the lashes. I'm not a big fan of the lashes, but we're going to wing with it. So if you guys don't know, this is $3.99 at Casa Kevin, downtown McAllen. If any of y'all live here, just saying. And there's a lot of other chokers. So go ahead, run, buy your makeup too. There's not even makeup there. Um... So yeah, I'm going to put my, all my social medias down below so you guys can go follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, yeah, that. and I also have a makeup page on Facebook so you guys can go follow me. Um, so yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Thumbs it up if you enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in the next video.